Hey guys, it's me again. Here with a little workout video. I may have told you last time that this would be on trains. I'm sorry, we had a couple of difficulties with the trains. And um, so I figured to do a workout video. All right, um, you can really use anything in your house. Um, I am on carpet right now. If you're on, if you're ever on cement, then you might want to have these pads I have, just so you can, um, so you're not freezing when you do your exercises. Now, um, you at least want three weights. Biggest, as you can see, I have 12 pounds, um, 10 pounds, medium size, and a small, five pounds. And so, um, that's all you're gonna need for this video for this workout um all right let's get started we're going to start with a simple 30 seconds plank position now i know this might get a little tiring so you can drink some water if you want in between all right ready and go he's going to hold that plank you want to you want to have a nice straight back level you're just going to hold it for 30 seconds 10 more seconds Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and stop. Now, give yourself a 30 second rest. You're doing good so far. Then, you're gonna get your smallest palm weight, which are my fives. Now, after my 30 seconds is up, you want to go, not yet, but you want to go up and then up again, down and then down again. So that's what you're going to do. And three, two, one, and start. And remember, you want to keep your back straight. And go at your own pace. You don't want to go too fast. You don't want to go too slow, because if you go too slow, you're not going to get as many in. But if you go too fast, you're going to, um, you'll, you might, um, um, anything. You could strain yourself, anything. You're just going to keep this up for two, one, zero. And then 30 second rest again. Now, if you would like, you can give yourself a smaller amount of rest. This gets harder, so I would prefer you give yourself 30 seconds when it gets a little bit harder. Now, in 10 seconds, we're gonna do the plank position again. Not yet, but you wanna make sure your back is straight the entire time. You don't wanna lift your butt too high, because then it's not a plank. It's more like a downward dog. Ready? And go. And then hold this as long as you can. You don't want to hold it too long where you're almost out of breath and you can't breathe. That happens with me sometimes. Ten more seconds. And then I have to stop. You want to put your knee down for a second. You can. And then let's go back up. Five, four, three, two, one and stop. All right, next, you're gonna give yourself 30 second break. I don't have any water, Gatorade. I would suggest you drink Gatorade on the breaks, but you don't wanna guzzle the Gatorade. <laughs> because if you guzzle the Gatorade, then you're gonna be full. 10 more seconds. You're gonna take your, me your medium, and not yet, but you're going to start here. You're going to go up. You're going to go back down. Ready? And start. And hold on. And start. Up. Down. Up. Down. Up. Down. You're just going to keep doing this. For 30 seconds. Now remember, if you start to... It doesn't matter what pound weight you have, but if you just start to, if you start to feel your arms shake, 
put go like this and wait a second until you, until you're ready. You don't want to go down and stop. And get you remember give yourself the 30 second break this time because it's getting a little tiring for my, for many of you probably. If it's not, give yourself a a lower break, um, a less time break. 15 more seconds. Not drink because it is well, I'm just gonna get no break. Three, two, one. You're gonna do a plank position again. Start. Bump back straight, but not too high in the air. And remember, like I said, if this gets too tired for you, put a knee down a second. You don't want to put it down too long because then it's a plank for 10 seconds. 10 more seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, and stop. All right. So now you're not going to stop. You're going to go right into that 30 seconds. You're going to get a nice pace jogging in place. If you do have a, I have a big basement. So if you, um, if you do have to, you can, um, well, if you're doing it in your basement, you could, um, put jog around your basement. Just make sure nothing's in your way. Time's up. I give you, now give yourself that 30 second break. I'll be right back. Just hold on one second. I gotta talk to the cameraman. Alright guys, I'm back. 10 more seconds to rest. Now, you're gonna get them heaviest weights. Five seconds. Five, three, two, one, and you're gonna pick up them weights. Start now. You're gonna go up, down, up, down, up, and down for the full 30 seconds. Just make sure your back's straight. You don't wanna go like this because you could hit your head, which I have done before, and you don't wanna swing back because then you're just hurting your back. Now, like I said, you can give yourself like a five second break, put the weights down a second. Stop. And give yourself that 30 second break again. Now we're gonna do the same thing for the, um, the same thing we just did. So next, you're gonna do mountain climbers. If you don't know what mountain climbers are, you wanna be in the 10 more seconds, you want to be in the push-up position and you want to bring the knees to your elbows like that. A couple more seconds. All right, and start. Wait. Hold on. Technical difficulties. And hold on. And go. As you can see, my other mouth is starting to slide. So I would just move up. And it doesn't really matter, I can go like this. I can bend it back a little. But you don't want to go too far back that you hit the wall. Now like I said, you can put that knee down for a minute, 10 more seconds, or for a second. They do make some squilly noises. Stop. All right, you want to rest for 30 seconds. If that mat does come off, if a mat does come off, then just fix it while you have that break. That's where also that break time is good for. Ten more seconds. Now we are going to go right into jogging. Jogging in place. Five, four, three, two, one, and start your exercise. too much noise you can go onto the hard ground as you can see I have carpet so I'm fine if you don't want to get your feet too cold because you might not have slippers on or socks 
the best thing would do is to wear socks, like maybe a little grip socks. Two, one, zero. So you want 30 second break, but you want to wear them grip socks in case you happen to slide, even on concrete. If you're on concrete, you don't have mats. Like I said, you can get these mats from Five Below, Target, Walmart, practically anywhere you can go online on Walmart, online on Amazon. Amazon obviously has these mats, just shirts, um, gym and exercise mats. A couple more seconds. And, and so next, you're gonna do jumping jacks. For 30 seconds, in, out. You don't wanna just do this. Because if you just do this, that's no, no point. You don't want to just do this because that's no point. You want to make sure those feet are fully extended. Like I said, if that makes too much noise for you, um, it's perfectly fine. Just move somewhere else. Five seconds. And if I stop, that doesn't mean you have to stop. All right. So now... You're gonna rest for them 30 seconds. We're almost done. Don't worry, we're almost done. Next, you're gonna try to try to do push as many as you can. And I'm, not, I'm not asking you to do 30. I'm not asking you to do 15. I'm asking you to at least do 10. Five, four, three, two, one and go. Remember, push up position up, down, up, down. Same thing all the way through. If you don't want to go, you can do a couple of these where you bring your chest down, but your arms have to be in by your ribs. You can't do a push up, that's what you can do. Like I said, you can put your knee down and rest for a minute. seconds. Four, three, two, one, and stop. All right, you can give your rest 30 seconds. Now, I am not going to do it, but I have a couple, I might do it, I have a couple, I have a challenge for you. Repeat everything, but go one minute, one minute round, and then only all you get is a 30 second rest. That's my bonus challenge for that one. Now with my other ones, I will not be doing the bonus challenge. All right, so after your 30 seconds is done, you wanna go one minute, one minute and 30 seconds. So your full time is two minutes. I'll be right back. I have to, I have to speak to the cameraman again. All right, sorry, I took so long I had to speak to the cameraman. Sorry if you hear any creaking, flushing the toilet. My um, my friend just went to the bathroom, so um, we got 30 more seconds left. We went through a full minute. All right, next, I call this one the burpee challenge. You wanna, you wanna get in that nice, um, push up position and a burpee is like this not yet but you're gonna go in out in jump up and then you don't want to jump too high but you want to jump so you go like this almost a like jumping jack all right you're gonna do now there's gonna be no time limit on this well there is a kind of a time limit so what you're gonna do first is 
get down on the ground. You're gonna do in, out, in, up. It's one burpee. You know, you don't wanna give yourself too long for one burpee, so I'm just gonna give myself a 10 second rest. Now, as I do more burpees, the rest time should get higher as you go along because you'll need that full, we'll go up to 30 seconds, you'll probably need that full 30 seconds. So now, you're gonna go one, two, one, jump up. And then now, since you just did one, you're gonna do two. And then you can still give yourself that 10 second break. I would, I encourage you to not give yourself a too long of a break, but it um, doesn't matter. I'm just gonna tell you how much time I'm giving myself a break. Now what you're gonna do is one, one, two, three. And you're just gonna do three burpees. Now I'm giving myself 15 second rest because that was a couple. I do deserve it, you do too. And because I'm out of breath. Now, you can't give yourself a, a five minute rest in between that, the weights exercise and the burpee challenge. All right, now what I'm gonna do is, what comes after three? If you guess four, you're correct. One, two, three, four. Now, now that I did four, I'm giving myself a 20, 25 second rest. You give yourself however much time you feel is right. You don't want to give yourself too much or too low because then if you have something important to do after, anything else important to do after, you're just wasting time. Now, after this burpee challenge, I will finish most of it. I will not do the next challenge. I will, I will do some of it. All right, now, what comes after? What comes after four, five, one, two, three, four, five. Now, I'm giving myself the full 30 second break. I'm sorry, this cameraman, I have to talk to him again. Hold on one second. I'm just gonna go down for a quick walk. Yeah. Ten more seconds. Sorry, I have to, I have to talk to him. He keeps, ah, oh, don't worry about it. It's all right. One, zero. Now, you can do six burpees. One, two, three, four, and five. Now I'm gonna give myself a full 30 second rest again. And all you should go to is 30 seconds. I need to move these weights because as you can see, my mat is not holding up that well. So, I'm throwing my mat in here with all the other junk. I have some of my workout equipment, some of my. Now, what comes after five? If you guess six, you're right. Now I'm gonna do six burpees. Or if I already did six, you're gonna move on to seven. Whatever. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now, I would suggest that we go up to the 30 second break because if you only give yourself 30 seconds, it's not too challenging. Catch your breath, do what you can. Eight seconds. Four, three, two, 
One and zero. All right, you gonna get back on? Then you're gonna do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Up the 30 second rest, but I did 10. I still missed eight and nine, right? You, I would recommend you doing them if you did 10, go back to eight and do nine. Now, what's next is 10 more seconds nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And um, all right, so next, what you're gonna do is well, I didn't do it, but after you do that, you can pause this video, do your rest if you want. Now, what's next is you know, I gave a bonus challenge for that one. I'm gonna give a bonus challenge. Your bonus challenge is repeat, get um, rest one minute break after you do all 10, one through 10, and then. Repeat the challenge, but start with 10. Can you do that? All right, then let's move on to the next challenge. I will not be doing this challenge. I will demonstrate it a couple times, but you will be doing it. All right, ready? So what's next is, you know, I showed you mountain climbers with them, pads. You're gonna do mountain climbers again like this. And he said, you're not gonna be on the time limit. You need 10 of them. Now, I will show you how to count. Usually you could count by seconds, but in this video, I would recommend not to. One is when you go one and two. Two of, two of reaching up to your elbow is one. So one, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So you can do ten of them. You can give yourself however long of a break. But I recommend only going up to 30 seconds for this whole video. For this and this whole video. Alright, um, so what's next is I'm not keeping track anymore. After you do that, you're gonna move on to 15. You can give yourself however set how many however Many second break, and then you're, then you're gonna do 20, then you're gonna do 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, and then you're gonna go up to 50. And my bonus challenge for this one is rest one minute and 30 seconds, which adds on to a complete two minutes. And then my bonus, my final bonus challenge is repeat it, but start with 50. Start with 50 this time. Can you do that? I hope you can. It's quite tough to do, but I hope you can. I thank you, and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up. And if you want to see more of these videos, please subscribe to my channel. Um, also, I just want to give a shout out to my cameraman, Daylin. And see, you might not know him. Um, some of you might know, but, um, uh, that's all for this video. My next video is definitely going to be Train City, and I'm changing something up. You just have to go to Matthew, at capital M, lowercase a, T, T, H, E, W, Matthews, Matthew, space, capital A, apostrophe, small s, Matthew A's and then an all lowercase channel and then um, you'll see all of my videos that's what I'm going to start naming them like I said look on the air by 740 or 745 around there at night not in the morning the morning would be crazy but um, at night p.m. and um, so this one's going to be called um, Matthew's Ch Matthew A's channel all right.
I'll see, um, I guess I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.